It's still circular, and there's no way in or out. I was suddenly just wrong, wrong about everything, wrong. If you tried to explain yourself and correct the misunderstanding, it would then begin to heighten. Miss Heard was uh, unable to be wrong. It just didn't happen. She couldn't be wrong. It just didn't happen. She couldn't be wrong. It would commence with sort of demeaning name-calling into uh, a full-scale argument. The argument would start here, and then it would roll around and become this circular, circular thing of its own. So circular, get back to the beginning, essentially, of the argument. Now it's heightened even more, but it's still circular, and there's no way in or out. But it's still circular, and there's no way in or out. There was no way to fit a word in. Rapid fire, sort of endless uh, parade of <laughs> insults and looking at me like I was a fool. I was sort of not allowed to be right, not allowed to have a voice, not allowed to have a voice, not allowed to have a voice. And when you've told that person your, your life and what you've lived through and what you've been through, the more that became uh, ammunition, ammunition to um, either verbally decimate me, decimate me, or to send me into a, a kind of tailspin of confusion and d depression. And then it increased, increased, and it became an endless, that endless circle like to ramp up so fast. It was like you were pinned to a wall and had just listened to it and take it. Pinned to a wall and had just listened to it and take it. There were times when um, I, w I would just go and lock myself in the bathroom or anywhere that she couldn't get into. And that, that happened constantly, constantly, constantly. It seemed like pure hatred, pure hatred for me. If I stayed to argue that, eventually I, I was sure that it was going to escalate into violence and oftentimes it did now it's heightened even more it's pure still hatred, circular pure hatred, and there's no pure way hatred, in or pure out. hatred it's still circular 